We have to understand who our customers are. Have you been hearing the same things around financial health, uh, of health systems? Yeah, definitely at the beginning of the pandemic, it was obvious when everyone's canceling all of their elective uh, procedures. And then I think that was always an interesting conversation was people didn't understand what elective was, that having a benign brain tumor removed is actually elective surgery. So like the seriousness of elective surgery is quite high. Anyway, the, so it was obvious they were losing money. That was the first time I saw the full collective stat. And I was, I'm curious about what does that mean? Like, where are the, are the budget cuts coming or are they coming and where are they coming from? Or, and then also there's a, before this, the, the rural hospitals were in trouble, right? Like the safety net hospitals. So what is going to be the long-term fallout of this? I, I think I'm going to do a week on today in health IT on rural hospitals and their situation. I've been reading a lot of articles. I've been researching it. And the, the crazy thing is the reality is it's a major, it's a major challenge. And I, I think it presents a, a real significant opportunity for us in healthcare if we really think through it. But I don't want to go into that just yet because I'm just still forming my thoughts on that. In, in terms of where, where do cuts come from? Unfortunately, they're going to come from operations and that can be anything from administrative cuts to nursing and some other areas that it's hard to make those. I've been at a system where we had to make those cuts and it's really hard to make those cuts. And it's hard to justify too, because you're letting people go and they look at you and go, don't we have a billion dollars in mm -hmm. investments and mm -hmm. don't we collect money in philanthropy? And But you have to ask yourself, is the role of the health system to provide employment? I think the answer to that is somewhat it is. They're the largest employer in the community, but part of that is to remain fiscally healthy in order to provide employment for and, and care for the community as well.